Hello everybody, you're watching ad-free Tenacious Viking TV. Welcome back to Sim Airport. I'm Tenacious Viking, your airport manager host. We are deep in the bowels of the airport. We are in the the first level below ground level and we've got a bunch of the infrastructure in place uh, to try to figure out <laughs> the whole baggage thing. I think I have enough space here to go up to ground level and place the baggage depot if I turn it sideways yes right there now are there several spots Two, three, four. Doop, doop. Let's see, I got. Okay, I can put it right there. Alright, now let's see where that's going to be. Oh boy, oh boy. I uh, kind of wish. Yeah, yeah, let's, um, let's cancel that. And, uh,. I wonder if I can place it on, on, on that. I don't think I can place it on that level, can I? This is learning process, folks. I'm, uh... Nope, it's got to be on the main main floor. So, I want to do... do 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 I want to be over this way as far as I can, I think. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this is going to work. This is going to work. Um, all right. Uh, okay. <laughs> How do I get? On ground floor requires connection. F what do you mean on ground? Oh, okay. Requires connection from a baggage hub. Requires connection to a baggage hub. Must be assigned to an aircraft gate. Requires at least one functional hangar with a baggage car. Okay, I got a hangar. I'll get the <laughs> get the uh, get the baggage car in place so that we don't have that excuse. And then okay. From a baggage hub to a baggage hub. Okay, that's out. That's in. So, oh boy. I, 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 I don't know where to put the baggage hubs. Because I don't know how big they are. Let's see, that's out. That's up. All right. Uh, I'm gonna forget that. I'll have to. I'm sure I'll have to do that again. Baggage hub. Baggage hub. Baggage hub. Baggage hub. Baggage hub. Baggage hub. Um. Boop boop. See, I don't really want to put it there. I kind of want to. How come I can? How come there's room for two? Oh, because of the yeah. So I really need. I need these things up here. Or maybe here. I wonder if I can do that. I'm thinking that then I can connect to the baggage bays off to the left. I can oh, I need I'm gonna need it up here because if I if I have if I need another one, which I might, I can put that to the left then. Yeah, and I am. I'm going to need more. I, 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 well, maybe not. Maybe I can chain a bunch of them together now without having to have a baggage hub for every single one. I'm not sure. But I am going to have to connect up two of these, and I don't know if I can cross conveyors either. That's going to be an exciting deal. Okay, then I need one this way. Um, and I think I need to go way over here with this, like up here. Um, I'm not gonna like 
I hope I don't have to run uh, a separate uh, line to each each ticketing desk. I hope I can just run one line up and, and hook them up in parallel. Because <laughs> um, I wonder if I'm probably going to need if I run up here and hook and hook up over here. I think I'm I think I'll be in pretty good shape. Uh, but I gotta figure out how to do that yet, cause yeah. Oh boy, I hope. <laughs> yeah, let's go up and see where we're at here. Um, if I go up under the security area, right now I have stuff here, and I don't know where that is. I have no clue. No clue. Yeah, but I'm going to have to go up right about here. I wonder if I can tell where that is. So let me let me do a little measuring here and so I get this right. Uh, let's go 30 Um yeah, if I start it here and just I'll, I'll just go I don't know about maybe eight over and run that up. I think. Okay, so I need thirty, and then um, then I can go from here eight. Eight over and up, way up. I don't even want to activate this until I'm sure I got everything in place. Um, can I build a lower level without having? Well, I'm going to have that there anyway. I think I can do that, can't I? A foundation under here. To hopefully run conveyor belts. Boy, oh boy. I, I suppose I'm going to need a couple more right under them, aren't I? Alright. That's going to take a while. How are we doing on money? We're doing alright for now. Um, I could start... Ah, oh boy. Um... Yeah, I got to get this stuff out of here and get these restrooms moved because I need to move security up a ways. Because I, I don't think this is going to be enough baggage room. Yeah, I'm going to need I'm going to need this closed off. Gosh, this is not going to work at all, is it? I'm going to have to move the uh, security exit here, which is okay. I can do that. Um and then put a, a nice maybe about four exit gates here for arrivals uh, yeah I use this space for that I have so much remodeling to do ugh but I, I yeah, but you know I'm making progress and I, and I like that aspect of it I wonder if we have any airline interest yet very well one two three four Five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got enough for another another gate. I could add another one, uh, but I'd like to get the baggage thing in place and maybe get the satisfaction uh, up enough to get some better airline interest. I also need to spend some time off camera, as I said, I think in the last episode, uh, getting some of these bigger planes off of the small gates and getting them onto the uh, large gates and then getting some some of these small planes over on small gates. Switch, swap them around so that there's more uh, more appropriate <laughs> gate size. Uh, I really don't want anything s smaller than a 737 at the large gates, and I don't want anything bigger than the, like about a hundred passengers, maybe a few less at the at the small gates because it's, it's just not it's not a good idea. 
Okay, I got a. I can assign uh, gates, so I'll do that. All right, we got that done, and I gotta try this. Uh, let me do this. Let me. Oh, oh wrong, I just go the wrong direction. Why do I do that, man? Okay, so conveyor, where's the conveyor? Utilities. A two-way conveyor. I don't think I need that, do I? Well, it'd save money, wouldn't it? Go right up the middle here. Should I do that? You know what? I am, but I'm going to save first in case I really hate it. Uh, I had to save as a, a D last time because it would not save my existing... Um, over an existing one. Let's see if it does it. Okay, it did it now. That's So that's one of the bugs they I think they removed because I think they just updated that a little bit. All right, now let's try that. Um, there's so much noise. And uh, see if I can just get away with this. I, I don't know how to. I think I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to run it separately, aren't I? Eventually. I'll just save money by running a two way. I, I think. We'll see. Conveyor. Oh, conveyor up, conveyor down. Ooh, I'm gonna do that too. Well, okay. I don't know if this will work. I really don't. I don't know how you'd get the two. Huh. Uh, this could be a bad idea. But we'll wait and see. We we'll wait and see. Show wires. Oh, really? Okay. You know I have to get fuel done too. So there's that. All right. While we're waiting for that, let's take a look at uh, some of our. Well, we're we're about wrapped up for the day. Um. Okay, we got that. Uh, we don't. <laughs> we don't have that. It's uh. That, that's coming along. Okay. Cool. Uh. Let me get. out of here and um, I'm gonna have to do a single conveyor up here aren't I uh, so can I go that way yeah I can okay um, I think this goes up oh, for it, for me. I don't think I have to do that manually. Let's see if that works. I sure hope I can just go up to other baggage carousels without having to run a whole separate line. That's going to make me very, very sad. Very sad indeed. Uh, hmm. Okay. How are we doing here? Oh, I can start to, to dismantle this. I can I can take this out now because I can put that down in the uh, basement level for the CTO. And uh, I can start working, remodeling that too. Uh, I don't really want to do a lot more um, here uh, until we get the baggage in. I don't want to want to make the crew, the work crew, doing a whole bunch of other things when I really want them to prioritize this. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, the next thing we'll do is we'll take this wall out and start moving security up here. Um, and, and open this up for the security exit. Because this will be about in the middle eventually of the uh, two concourses, so that works out. And uh, I'm going to have to just kind of, I think, wall off departures here. Hmm. I wonder if I, I wonder if I should just keep those restrooms kind of there and move the doors to the other side so it'll be for arrivals, not for departures. Because departures can go to the bathroom before they leave security. I mean, it'd be nice if you could do both, and have 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 both of them. But um, I don't I don't know if it'll hurt me if I don't do that. I don't think it will. I'm just having a hard time envisioning how much space I'm actually going to have and um, maybe I build security so that it kind of funnels people you know from uh, getting their tickets just down a little ways and then over to the ID check stands because uh, right now they have kind of a ways to go but that's probably too far away isn't it? I don't know see how we're doing on this conveyor belt and then see if I can connect a single belt to it. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. You can't, uh, you can't connect it. So how how do you how do you connect it then? It's a two-way conveyor, but how do you hook it up? See, nothing, nothing, nothing works, so I don't know how to use that. I'm going to leave that in place and do some reading and see if I can figure out how you're supposed to do that. Um, because I don't know what the point is of having a two-way conveyor if you can't use it. Um... See, none of, none of these work. So that works, but how do you get stuff onto that? Okay, that's not hooking up. Hmm. So I'll, let me see. Uh, I'll figure out. Uh, see if I can figure out how this works. And if it doesn't, I'll take it down and put single um, conveyors in. This says it's doing something, but it's not getting anything to to do. So it's just a a false <laughs> uh, a false signal. Um, just shows that it's working and how it, what direction it's going. I guess. Uh, we could. I, I think if we. 
if we play a single one in, I think we can uh, check it and see if it works. But I'm going to do that off camera and, and try to get that working for you. But uh, in any case, um, we are uh, we're getting there on the baggage uh, system. Um, let me show. Uh, well, this this doesn't go anywhere, does it? <laughs> nope, it doesn't. This is what it'll look like when it's all finished. <laughs> there, <laughs> how's that? <laughs> and we're getting some good money in, so we got enough to f to finish this. I think um, that's great. Uh, my time is up for this episode. Man, time moves fast when you're building an airport, at least when you're designing it and trying to figure stuff out like I'm doing. Um, I hope you have the patience to stay with this. Uh, I'm enjoying it now. I've got you know, I got a little money to work with, and I'm, I'm, I'm learning some new things about how some of these things work. And I'll get this three-story you know, uh, terminal figured out eventually um, by hook or by crook and by trial and error, no doubt, but, but I'll get it figured out. So thank you so much for watching. Welcome new subscribers. I appreciate all of you very much. And I sure would appreciate your comments on Sim Airport. Uh, what do you think of it? Uh, am, am I, are you enjoying it? Uh, it? Does it look like I'm on the right track or am I doing something dumb? Um, are you interested in the game at all? Um, you know, any, any any information, any ideas and thoughts are very much appreciated. Uh, even something you think is kind of dumb. Let me know. Thanks again for watching. Join me next time when Tenacious Viking plays Sim Airport. And remember, in a world that is increasingly mean and full of lies and personal attacks, I think that we would all benefit if all of us just try to be kind. Oh.